Olave, what is Islamophobia? You know, I'm not an expert on any of these things. Eh? Do people know this? Islamophobia. Another one of those phobias, right? So it's about uh, irrational fear. And when is the rational fear of uh, the Islam and people who are Muslim turn into attitudes and real life consequences for people, you have Islamophobia. So on the one hand, it's a, like I said, an irrational fear of the Islam and of Muslims. And that fear can involve a number of things, can involve the idea that, for example, the Islam is very dangerous uh, very a threat to our our safety so Islam becomes equated to the potential for terrorism um, it can involve the fear that Islam is taking over the world um, it involves the idea that Islam is inferior as a religion or as a religious political philosophy as well so that's another thing eh? the idea that Islam is a political philosophy um, it involves these ideas about the Islam uh, being oppressive towards people who follow it. Towards women, towards queer people, towards, you know. Everyone, pretty much. Um, Islamophobia involves uh, also justifying this fear, justifying violence towards Is Muslims and towards uh, Is Islamic countries, justifying it as something that is logical because it's such a dangerous ideology political ideology it is such a huge threat so we need to be violent towards it and that's okay um islamophobia so many things islamophobia involves for example uh, also limiting access for example social services to public spaces to even your country to uh, human rights limiting access to human rights and and uh, you know these things for Muslims because Muslims are dangerous right and I think Islamophobia has also really grown in in the modern day context to mean to be, sort of be seen as something that is normal the fear of Islam the fear of Muslims and the policies that follow from that that it's almost seen so normal that it's almost seen as something natural, you know, to be afraid of Islam and to try to contain Islam is considered something progressive, right? So if you look at the dialogue, the way that politicians in the in the Netherlands, like Forum for Democracy or PVV or Faith Day, they all talk, say they are Christian, they talk about their fear of Islam as something very progressive, something very no, like actually, why are you not afraid of Islam, right? Like. Don't you get it? Don't you really know enough? From what I've come to understand, Islamophobia is not something new. It's something that is very, very, very old, that has been a very important part of European identity. This fear of Islam and this fear of Muslims has been a very important for hundreds of, for centuries, it has been a very important part of the construct of the European identity in a political sense, in an economic sense, but also in a philosophical and cultural sense. The sort of demonized status that Islam and Muslims have um, is actually a fundamental value. So the Islamophobia is actually a fundamental value of European identity. That's how I think I can explain Islamophobia quite quickly and <laughs> Try to explain it at least. <laughs> Was that that look?